shake up some things, my God. We have authority to bring heaven down to earth. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I pray that you all understand what I'm saying because the Bible said, in all you're getting, get understanding. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God, in the book of Joshua, I forgot to share this testimony. A woman of God uh, had called me, and she's from Houston, and never seen her. She never seen me. I don't know her. She don't know me. But my sister, did, uh, and, and my, these are my sisters in Christ Jesus, uh, Pat and, and Kim. These are my warriors that's on the phone with me. And, and, and um, they had signed my name up for a conference, and I wasn't able to go in. But the woman of God called me one day, and I was on my way to Nita House, and and uh, my phone rang, and I'm, I always ask my phone because I don't know if somebody in trouble. A lot of people say, I don't know their number, I'm not answering my phone, but I answer my phone unless I just feel like cutting it off. And so, <laughs> and so, <laughs> amen. <laughs> and so the woman of God, she, uh, she, uh, she, she, she said she was going through some papers, some papers, because she had a conference, and she was going through some papers, and she said, uh, Pastor Juanita Jones, and I said, Pastor Juanita, that's what she said, Pastor Juanita. And I said, yes ma'am, and she said, uh, I met you at the conference, I said, no ma'am, no you haven't. She said, well you were here, I said, no I wasn't. And she said, well I, the Lord told me, I went through all these papers, he said, stop. And I said, okay. And so I want to hear what God was saying, because I'm going through some stuff, so I'm trying to hear. About the word of the Lord said, those that have an ear, let them hear what the Spirit of the Lord is saying. My God. And so she began to start sharing. She began to start praying for me. First of all, she asked me, did I have a prayer request? And I was kind of hesitated about it because, you know, I don't kind of want to put stuff out there. And, and I, I went on and told her a few of the things. And she held the phone, but she knew it was more. Amen. And so I just gave her a little something. And she began to pray and prophesy. And, and, and began to just tell me some awesome things and a lot of things was confirmation and some things that I really had been seeking and praying and, and, and asking God for and the woman of God, I mean God used this woman. We never met, never met. Her name is Jacqueline Davis. Her and her husband is a pastor. And, uh, and so she began to start ministering to me, ministering to me. And uh, then she told me to go, she said, change your uh, scriptures and where you go in the Bible. Because sometimes, you know, have you ever been when you just lean on something for a while? And, but we, we got to know when we're in the season, we got to know the scriptures and chapters to go to. Amen. And so I, I love my Psalms 91 and Ephesians. And, you know, I, I got to put on the full arm of God and I got to read the prayer of protection. And, you know, they, these are something my, I do daily. And she said, change something. You know, some of us don't like changing. We get too comfortable where we are. Yeah. Amen. We get in a place where we just comfortable in. And God will send somebody and that thing will be shifted. Amen. And so God sent a woman to God and, and she began to minister to me. And she said, go to the book of Joshua. I'm telling you, I don't even read Joshua. Yeah. I've read it before, but I'm just saying, I just don't even. Yeah. And she said, go to Joshua. And when I open that Bible, I just start weeping and crying. Because I know God was speaking to me through the book of Joshua. And so the church, we can, we can go in and possess the land. That's what God told Joshua them. Hallelujah. And for such a time as that, this, I needed that. God is an old time God. Yes, he, is. he might not come when we want him, but he's always on time. Yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God has given us the keys. We have the keys. I was having dreams about keys coming out my mouth. I called Pastor Randy about keys. God said, I'm giving you the keys. And we just got to learn how to use them. Amen. We got to learn how to get into them. Amen. 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 God don't want us to be ignorant. Amen. The word of the Lord said, for us not to be ignorant to save device. My God, if we only knew what was inside of us. If we only knew. My God. Someplace, some of us would be where we are today. If we only knew. And I can truly speak for myself. If I only knew. I've heard it from others. God mm -hmm. used men and women of God to prophesy, but do you really believe it? Do we really believe it? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I thank God for the power of prayer. Amen. Amen. The prayer, the power of prayer is a, it's, it's a weapon. Amen. Just like this war is. It's a weapon. 
It's a, and it's sharp. The word is sharp. Yes, it is. It's sharper than a two-edged sword. Amen. And if I cut you, yes, you will bleed. And that's how the word is. Oh, oh Lord. Pastor Raleigh's face, the way that I say if I cut you, the way her face is going to be. Praise the Lord. <laughs> <laughs> God has healed my mind. I'm, I'm healed in my mind. I won't cut you. I mean, God was so on my mind. I'm going to mess up something, but God has to stop me. About five, six years ago, maybe. maybe so. <laughs> <laughs> but God, <laughs> God, that is so awesome. Oh God, oh God. I, I don't want to hurt nobody. I know how to be hurt. I've been hurt so many times, and I don't want to. And I've hurt people. I've done a lot of bad things. I'm telling about a bad one. <laughs> I have heard many people, and I don't, I don't want to go around that thing no more. Uh -oh, yeah. I don't do it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I lift up key. And brother, I won't be long. Praise the Lord. I lift up key, and it means a used metal instrument by which the bolt of a lock is turned. Key means interest. We got access. Right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We have access. Yes. My God. Hallelujah. How many know prayer can move mountains? Oh, yes. 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 Hallelujah. Yes. The word of the Lord said, all we need is faith as a grain yes. of a mustard seed. Yes. And Matthew 17 and 20 says, if ye have faith <laughs> as a grain of a mustard seed, ye shall say unto this mountain, remove hence to yonder place. And it shall be removed, and nothing shall be impossible unto you. Hallelujah. I was going through some things this week, and I saw a proper sign to the ice box and to the cab music. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> Okay. It was dry up in there. It was dry, but God. But God, amen. God always have someone to come. Amen. My God. I was trying to figure out God and already worked it out. Yeah. My God. If we Amen. just move self out the way and let God be God, Amen. it'll be better for us. Amen. It'll be much better for us. Yes. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. There you go. Mm. Seek. Knock at the door. All right. <laughs> Hallelujah. 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 Praise the Lord. Glory we can speak to any situation that's in our life. That's right. And we can command it to go in the name of Jesus. Amen. My God, the power and authority God has given us. Yeah. Yeah. It's a tool. We just gotta learn how to use it. Amen. And we have in this season we have to speak those things. Yes. And sometimes have you ever been so discouraged where you can't even speak it? Yes. That's how it was. I know. But I guess what? <laughs> I never stopped praying for others on that prayer line. Amen. I was committed to the line Amen. and I was praying and willing for others. Glory. And I've always heard what you make happen for others. Come and make happen for, for you. you. Amen. To God be the glory. Amen. Hallelujah. You, Hallelujah. So if God promised you something, that what you've been praying for and seeking for, believe that it's going to come to I pass. That. I receive Amen. The name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. We serve an awesome God, a mighty God. Yeah. You know, when we pray, we give the enemy no authority to rule over our thoughts yeah. in action. Sometimes he do sneak in. Yeah. He sneak in. <laughs> he find you at your weakest. But, but the Lord said when we're weak, we're strong. Yeah. That's what the word says. Oh, bless you. Hallelujah. I'm going to talk about Elijah. He was a man that he prayed. He prayed for rain. Yeah. He said it didn't rain and it didn't rain and he prayed.